morning, church. My name is Busi Siwe. Uh, these are my testimonies. Um, I'd love to thank God. Uh, I, I fell two years ago and I, I teared a ligament on my left knee. Um, since then, my leg has not been the same. But then, two months ago, we were here at church and Prophet prayed for us. Um, and he stepped his foot on my foot. Since then, uh, I, I feel I feel I feel different. I'm healed. I no longer wear a kneecap. I used to wear a kneecap. I'm walking freely. I'm feeling well. People of God, put your hands for Master Jesus. Indeed, Jesus Christ is our ultimate healer. The Bible says, "By His stripes we are healed." And my, I, I have three testimonies. My second testimony, uh, it's about, um, I, I thank God for making life easy for me and my family. During COVID, even now during this uh, inflation, it has, been, it has been well with us. It's like we have a father in our house. All is well. We don't have any, any challenges. Amen. that testimony, I also thank God for his divine protection over my life. Because during COVID, uh, I, 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 I'm a nurse, I'm a staff nurse. During COVID, I used to work in the front line. They used to put me there. I don't know why. I was among the chosen ones who, who were there at the front line most, uh, most of the days. And we used to pray. We used to, to, to worship God there and we would pray. Sing. I work in a private sector. People, they hardly lose their lives there, but we were experiencing so much loss of life. We used to pray, and God was our strength, and he protected me through the times of COVID. I, ne I was never, uh, I never tested positive. And my, uh, my, Final testimony for today, uh, I've been hoping to, to, to one day have a car. So I really struggled to get my license. The first time I tried, I had a challenge. The second time, I, I was sick. It, it's, it's about 10 years ago. Then I said, you know what, let me just leave this. And then in 2021, I tried again. Still, I had challenges. Last year, I tried early. Still, I had challenges. But late last year, I got my license. Put your hands for Master Jesus. Indeed, people of God, God's time is the best time. And then this month, um, this month, early this month, I just woke up one Friday. I said to my sister, let's just go and shop for cars. We anointed ourselves, said, may heaven go before us. We went to the first car dealership. We, we viewed the cars. We loved them. We fell in love with this other one. And then we moved from that one to the other one. I loved the second one more than the first one. But my sister said, no, that one is not a vibey car. Then, uh, because we were not agreeing on the same uh, type of cars, then I said, let me just leave it for now, later on. But then my younger brother intervened and said, no, you're not, you're not stopping. Let me speak to someone I know, then we will see. They, he spoke to that person, and then it was like today, maybe at three, they sent papers to that person. Eight o'clock the following day, I was from work. I do night shift, so I was tired. I, I just wanted to sleep. I get a call, then I answer. And this person, he sounded like a young person, early 20s. He's excited over the phone, and then he's commanding me. Come and fetch your car. You said you want Swift, uh, a Suzuki Shift, Suzuki uh, Swift. And then I said, this person now is the one who's excited as if the car is his. And I haven't even chosen the car. I don't know this person. Then I said, you know what? Uh, can I please call you in the afternoon? I slept. I didn't tell my, 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 my siblings. I was just called. I, I was no longer interested with, with the car thing. And then in the afternoon, I tell them when I wake up. I think it was... Some, somewhere to 1, 1, 1, 1 p.m. 
I tell them, I say, there's this, car who, there's this guy who called. Did you speak to someone? They say, yes, we spoke to someone, but we didn't tell that person what kind of car we want. But then I was like, not interested at all. But they were like, we are going. Let's just go and view the car. I said, okay. We requested so that it will be quick because it was 2 p.m. already. And, you know, they closed maybe 4 or 5. So we took a, a, a bolt and then we went. When we got there, nothing much was said. We just fell in love with the car. And then we just took the car. Um, sister, is this your car that we're seeing in our screens? Yes, 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 ma'am, it is the car. When Put I your hands for Master Jesus. When I saw the car, I, I, I found the car to be very stylish. I said, God is very stylish. <laughs> we serve a very creative God. Hallelujah. So, people of God, as she said that um, her car that she got, she didn't even pick it. Someone else picked it for her. And it shows how creative our God can be. Trust in the Lord and lean not unto your own understanding. In all thy ways, acknowledge him and he shall, he shall lead thy path. Amen. Ma'am, can you please um, share with us your word of advice? My word of advice is for someone who's sitting here. I was also like you. I would sit here and listen to testimonies. And when people would testify, I would say, she's saying that because already she's there. You know? So if you are in that place where I was, just know that it will happen for you also. One day you will also stand here and testify. Yeah. 